Hello there, Cancer. Welcome back. I hope you guys are doing well today. This is going to be for anybody with Cancer placements in their chart. Make sure you all flip and you switch the roles. Take it resonates. Leave it doesn't fit for your situation, guys. Thank you so much for your love, your support, and your donations. I'm sending you guys um, a lot of love and lights and happiness on your journey. Anything you guys need to know about me is going to be down below in the description box. And please be aware of the fake pages that are on here and on any other social media platforms, okay? So let's see Cancers, my Cancerians. Let's see what's going on with y'all. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, guys and goddesses, please return any spell work and the dark magic that is sent to harm Cancer and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones are turning back to the sender. Block any interferences that could be stopped from the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages from my Cancer Collective and protect me as I channel the messages here for Cancer. Hearing something about strawberry lemonade. Somebody's drinking some strawberry lemonade. Or you're making some. I'm hearing something now about Kool-Aid. You could be making some Kool-Aid for your kids. Or you like Kool-Aid. <laughs> okay. I've never really been a Kool-Aid fan. It's too much sugar. I don't know. But um, let's see what's going on for cancer. So we have umbrella love here. Shelter, connection, protecting one another, sticking out the storm, defending each other. Okay, period. With the umbrellas here, you guys could be experiencing some up and down like energy. Okay, or like, um, you know, with umbrellas comes the rain or bad weather. So maybe something is going on between you and a, a particular person that you're with. Okay, yeah, introspection. So we have crickets, silence, no response, communication delays, left on red. Give me another for cancer. But I feel like you and this person are protecting each other, though, which is good, whether y'all going through ups and downs or not. It's an exaggeration, melodramatic, blowing things out of proportion, not that deep. can't even in the reverse can't deal with the situation don't know what to say or do can't comprehend shaking my head wow so that's in the reverse so somebody here can't comprehend it acting like they're slow but they're fucking not <laughs> okay is what i'm getting with that like okay we got tea sipping here feeding into rumors listening listening to juicy gossip and everyone's business thrives off of drama so somebody here knows the truth about something but they feel like you're 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 being too um serious or it's not that serious it's like bitch yes the fuck it is that serious what the hell do you mean you might feel like you you blowing shit out of proportion or you shouldn't be acting the way that you're acting no why do you feel like that way honey so that way you can get back in with me good or whatever it's like we would never be okay <laughs> that's what i'm like that's how i feel about um this shit that's coming out right now that's how i feel like you're feeling cancer i'm like what the fuck somebody's trying to invalidate your feelings it's like bitch move the fuck on then why you keep coming up in these readings if it's not that deep why the fuck you keep thinking about it your energy is coming into the readings bitch if it's not that deep then why the fuck are you still here let's talk about something else why are we keep talking about you lame assholes answer answer me that bitch in the comments if you're watching so what's umbrella love here audacity for me <laughs> my cancer mars come out every time i do y'all reading like with cancer and mars here bitch what's uh the umbrella love mars is already the the, the planet of aggression and fighting and shit y'all better stop playing with me what's this umbrella love here uh, cancer is already a very emotional sign okay what's umbrella love the eight of swords in the reverse gemini jupiter so a restriction has been lifted here or any kind of like um self-sabotaging behavior or any kind of like any thing going on with your mental health your mind i feel like you're coming out of that you've overcome some sort of mental entrapment possibly what's umbrella love here with the eight of swords in the reverse okay yeah four swords in the reverse good yeah Libra Jupiter, so confirmation of what I just said, finding the mental strength here, finding the mental strength, coming out of isolation here, rejoining the world again, okay, or this is just about your mental health, okay, your mental health is getting better, it's your healing, 
okay i feel like you're trusting in spirit because you know that you're protected yeah five of wands nine of swords it's just like what is the conflict about bitch yeah seven of wands the temperance so protection so if you're in a connection here with umbrella love i feel like for some of you you are you and this person communicate very well i feel like spiritually and mentally y'all don't stay stuck and shit for long y'all communicate y'all talk it out or you you and this person have a really strong mental connection they could be helping you to heal your something with your mental health here like unknowingly because of y'all's connection whatever it is it's probably twins you're probably twins here y'all have a psychic connection or a very strong mental bond what's the eight of swords in the reverse Okay, yeah, the four pentacles. So yeah, if you if you're used to overthinking or if your person is, I feel like um you're not. You know how to work through shit. Four of pentacles, Capricorn energy. So this is like um Yeah, I feel like that is kind of like that shelter energy, that protection, that um holding on to something okay i feel like you and somebody are in love with each other or some shit <laughs> this could talk about like having control like really keeping a tight grip on something here like it's your mind you're not letting your mind play tricks on you what's the eight of swords in reverse four of pentacles or oh, this is somebody here holding on and shit child let's see yeah justice libra energy yeah so something here is balanced out or something here is getting ready to balance out here I feel like you've mastered like self-control with your mind. You, you don't, you don't just, you, you don't let your anxiety or you feeling overwhelmed or, or, or anything get in the way. Something here, somebody fuck with your mental health. Okay. Like bad. And I feel like now your nerves are becoming more stabilized or something is changing with your health here. Just period. Somebody here could be getting released from jail. Yeah, the King of Cups and the Two of Cups. So this this could be a Scorpio you're with here. This is somebody here that's in love with you. Very emotionally mature. That's why y'all can talk. And a, definitely a psychic bond, if this is your, your person. But um, somebody could be getting released from jail and they're coming out and they ain't got no money. So, I mean, that could be your man, child. Your, your man or your girl, whatever the fuck. I mean... If you're going to stick beside them shit, as long as it's making you happy, you know, I can't tell you what to do. But I'm just saying. Okay, what's Four of Pentacles? <laughs> Y'all funny. Yeah, the Knight of Cups. Yeah, something is, it, it is sheltered. I feel like this is somebody that you're dating. The Tower, the Moon. Yeah, I feel like, I feel like this Tower moment here came, Cancer, or this is a Tower moment that you're experiencing now. And it's, 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 a, this is like divine intervention here. Whatever this tower is, is going to reveal something that's going to help you shift your perspective. Maybe it's a secret, but I don't feel like it's a bad secret. It's going to bring something back into balance. And whatever it is, you're going to transmute this energy. It's going to end or whatever somebody is like doing to you to make you think otherwise about your person. I feel like you, with these majors coming out, this connection is major. It's important, clearly. Yeah, something here. So, yeah, with the Knight of Cups, I feel like, um, what's the Four of Pentacles, Knight of Cups? Pisces here. Knight of Cups talks about following your heart. It talks about someone being graceful or diplomatic or a romantic gesture. Look, 10, 10 on the clock. What's the Four of Pentacles with the Knight of Cups? Someone could be a Capricorn sun. Six of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, with the Knight of Cups in reverse too, with it in reverse, it talks about somebody that's non-confrontational. So with it upright, I feel like you and somebody are going to have a talk. Okay, and I feel like it's going to make the connection grow stronger as well. Okay. Six of Swords in the reverse. It's definitely like slow progress or slow healing. So somebody could still be healing from something. This could be like somebody trust issues or some shit creeping in or whatever this mental thing is that somebody got going on. I feel like it's getting ready to be over with. 
okay? Somebody, I feel like whatever this is y'all do, or however y'all get ready to reconnect or connect, it's going to make you feel even more sure. Because there's going to be honesty here with the justice. Okay? I feel like you you are, too, learning how to stand your ground in situations. I feel like, too, this is a situation where it feels like if you're scared, if you're normally scared to speak up or you have abandonment issues or wounds like that and you don't speak up about it or when you finally do speak up about it, rather, you get left, that's not your person. I feel like you can already see that this is your person, okay? Because I feel like a conversation is not going to go how you expected it to go. It's going to go better than what you expect. And I feel like it's going to help y'all grow stronger, okay? Like, that's what I'm getting. Um, somebody could be saving up for a wedding ring okay some of y'all could be eloping justice here with the six of swords in reverse go look up the six of swords in the reverse that's eloping <laughs> somebody could be budgeting or trying to save up or whatever this is somebody's not overthinking it no more or having cold feet or something Mm. but they're not in their head no more something made someone feel like much better or more secure okay for some of you yeah somebody's heartbroken about this <laughs> whoever this is right here what's this justice spirit for some of you somebody's gonna come out of jail for some of you and want to come back so, you know, this person could be possessive, greedy, controlling, whatever. Six of Souls in the reverse is like somebody trying to trap you or like out of the frying, out of, out of the fire and into the frying pan. Here's something getting worse. Trouble headed your way and shit like that. What's the, so just be mindful. I don't know. What's the justice? Yeah, the page of pentacles. I'm telling you, bro. I'm telling you. Somebody going to give your ass a ring or some shit. Or something tangible, something that you can feel. I feel like you you, you and this person are in the beginning stages of something, possibly. Y'all building on something solid, okay? You're building on something solid here. So somebody's plans, I feel like it's going to be able to, like, move forward or... Yeah, it's like something is... Whatever this was, it's like rocky waters here. You didn't... Something was filling off. I feel like you confronted it. The person that you're dating... And the way how y'all handle it or communicate is really helpful because y'all are moving forward. That's just period. Okay, so good shit. It feels good. Page of Pentacles, I feel like that's some of y'all could be eloping though. That's a ring or some shit. They could be keeping shit close to their chest. Like they're not letting you know. But yeah, Six of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. But um, someone here could be a reader. You could be a tarot reader here. It's not everybody. But. You could be getting a raise in promotion in your work. Some of you guys could be studying. You could be a paralegal or you could be in school for becoming a lawyer. What do you call that in school? I don't know. You could be getting a promotion, a raise, or this is like a level up in your, your journey with your person. What's the four swords in the reverse? The world. Yeah, uh, closing out of a cycle and a new one. Is, is forming. I feel like the little things that you're doing, Cancer, you don't even realize that they're big for your journey. Like, you could just be thinking that you're working through problems or whatever. I feel like that's how it's supposed to feel because Spirit don't want you to get too overwhelmed. Yeah, Ace of Cups. It's like Spirit don't want you to, like, they, they do shit so that way you can get through the lesson anyway. Okay, you're not supposed to know. But with the world here, I feel like, yeah, this is like wholeness, completion, a new beginning. Somebody here could be moving, traveling. If you and this person live at a distance, somebody could be coming to see you. They're returning. That could be bad for some of you or this could be good, okay? But I feel like this is someone that's like genuine or some shit. <laughs> okay. What's the four swords in the reverse with the world? Page of Wands in the reverse. Okay, so, okay, the Hierophant and the Five of Swords, I mean, Five of Wands. So somebody is challenging someone that's in the position of power and authority. Okay. Somebody could be stressed the fuck out. Four of Swords in the reverse. 
feel like you close a cycle with whoever this four swords is person in, is, is in the reverse. Somebody's like having anxiety or they're in fear. Page of Wands in the reverse. I feel like somebody's behavior could be very predictable. Okay, somebody has maybe some inner child healing. Or this is what somebody is healing. Let's see. Page of Wands in the reverse. So somebody's behavior is like predictable. Or they When they don't get their way, they get loud. They throw tantrums. Maybe this is what's, what's helping somebody feel secure. Because this person could be understanding now that they don't have somebody that's like that they don't have someone here that's that's a loser and that's going to fucking fight them every time that they want to communicate their feelings or you if that's you i feel like that cycle of bullshit is closed i feel like they're understanding that which is making somebody feel safe they're it's easing their mind you know what i'm saying or yours yeah ten of cups the, the the magician the star the strength card the sun just period what's uh what's the page of wands in the reverse Cause I feel like this could be fear or like somebody's scared to communicate or some shit. But I feel like um you did it or you're getting ready to do it. What's the page of wands in the reverse? Okay, yeah. Okay, so what I said still stands. But this queen of pentacles in the reverse, this is a stupid hoe that is, they ain't got no fucking protection either. Four swords in the reverse. I feel like somebody's just a loser. They're having anxiety. They're the ones overwhelmed. So that four swords in the reverse could be something bad for their ass. Somebody feels like they don't need help or counseling or whatever the fuck this is. They need it a lot. Okay. Queen of Pentacles in reverse is definitely somebody that's jealous. So th this could be, this could be this person's like ex or yours, but I'm getting, this could be this Knight of Cups. This is a man that you're dating, you're divine feminine watching, or it could be flip the rose, child. This could be you as a man. I'm talking to you about your raggedy ass baby mama, whoever this Queen of Pentacles is in reverse, a gold digging hoe. They're a gold digger. They're money hungry. They're a cheater. They're a con. For some of you, somebody here cheated and a child was not yours. Somebody cheated and a child is not yours. This person here, I feel like that cycle is closed out. You don't have to worry about somebody being this way with you. If that's what you're worried about, they're not. Somebody has genuine intentions. So you're going to have to trust it. And if not, that's going to ruin the connection. That's just as plain as black and white. It's no gray area. <laughs> Yeah, this is a whole new world for you here. So you need to um, embrace it. Yeah, Ace of Swords, Ten of Wands, Three of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. Yeah. This person is a loser. Whoever this Queen of Pentacles is in the reverse, child. Um, what's the crickets here? Seven of Swords, Aquarius Moon. Somebody could be texting someone's phone constantly, saying nasty shit or just being a liar, a loser. It's like they always strategizing or planning and shit. I feel like they're not getting no fucking response. Somebody is texting someone's phone constantly being a fucking dickhead. What's the crickets here with the Seven of Swords? Seven of Cups, yeah. Somebody's trying to cause confusion. They're lying. Whatever this is. Somebody's confused about someone's plans. Yeah, the lovers, the, the fool, the two of wands, the moon. Yeah, the, the knight of swords. Someone is confused about someone's plans here. Someone could have a Scorpio Venus. 777 is here. So, bitch, you're being warned. Whatever the fuck you're doing, five of wands, you better pipe the fuck down, bitch. I'm telling you, what's the seven of swords? Someone could too be trying to like tap into your dream state. Because this, this queen of pentacles, they dib and dab in dark magic. They do. What, what's the queen of pentacles in the reverse? <clears throat> nine of wands. Queen of pentacles in reverse, nine of wands. Someone could have a sage. Moon. Yeah, somebody is constantly giving someone a hard time. It's like someone is always on guard or having to defend themselves. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles. This could be somebody, this could be something going on at your job. Or somebody is just constantly like <clears throat> working against you. You're having to protect yourself from this damn person. I feel like you're committed or in a committed relationship. You're trying to stay focused on that. And you have this hoe up here with a nasty ass. 
and 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 a bitch here that's cheating with a child that's not yours they got a problem it's like bitch how the fuck that's what i don't get about you hoes how the fuck you gonna run around and cheat and then have a baby on somebody cheating is one thing all this shit is bad but cheating is one thing but then you get pregnant you're being reckless as fuck you don't give a fuck about nobody but your raggedy ass self and you don't even give a fuck about yourself bitch you don't care about yourself and then you're gonna get mad because somebody want to leave you because they're finding out a child ain't theirs or whatever the fuck this is like you bitches need to get a grip and stop being so fucking lame and childish and slow as fuck how the fuck you gonna be mad because of, of, of something that you did i'm not i was about to say a mistake bitch ain't no fucking mistake you know what the fuck you did what's the seven of swords that's something that you consciously choose to do are you a fucking zombie are you walking with no brain bitch Okay, what's the Seven of Swords? It's like no excuse. Two of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, so somebody's money is fucked up. Something is, is chaotic, is messy as fuck with the Two of Pentacles in the reverse. Capricorn, Jupiter. Somebody makes poor financial decisions. I feel like somebody's just really inflexible. They don't want to bend or, fo or fold or anything like that. They just want to keep doing whatever the fuck they're doing, bitch. And that's what's going what's to land you somewhere but you're not gonna be over here doing this shit no more for much longer whoever this is two of pentacles in the fucking reverse somebody could be trying to cause communication problems between you and this damn masculine okay But something is definitely messy, though. Somebody, something is just out of control here. Somebody bit off more than they can chew on something. What's the Seven of Swords, Two of Pentacles in the reverse? The Tower in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like somebody's trying to avoid going, having to file bank, having to file for bankruptcy, or having to. Uh, somebody could be not letting someone talk to their children. Is what I just heard. This child could be far. They could like live at a distance or they live with their raggedy ass mama. Somebody's a horrible mother. Their child could be like a delinquent. Their child could be bad as fuck or somebody's child is. Or I don't know. Okay, yeah, I'm getting the story. <laughs> okay, Aries, Scorpio with the tower in the reverse. So yeah, somebody's trying to avoid, I feel like a financial loss. I feel like um, with the tower in the reverse, somebody's avoiding a tower moment from happening by ignoring this bitch okay so, or something like that somebody just resisting change too they don't want to transform or change what's the fuck is the tower in the reverse somebody don't want something to be revealed about them or they don't something like that they want to keep fucking around yeah the six of wands somebody's just trying to avoid being called out or someone could have a, a leo jupiter Somebody is just an attention seeker. They want money. Somebody needs help with money. What's the tower in the reverse with the six of wands? You bitches get on my fucking nerves. Yeah, the knight of wands here. Somebody here, they, they running around doing whatever the fuck they want to do. Okay, they just doing whatever. I feel like somebody, this knight of wands, six of wands energy could be like somebody here that broke free. Okay, so that could be you. Or this could be somebody that you're dealing with, this man or whatever. But somebody here broke free or something and they're, they're in the winning position. I feel like they feel confident about moving forward or they doing them. Somebody could be traveling, doing whatever the fuck they want to do. Celebrating or, you know, going on a new fucking adventure. Okay, if somebody here is trying to stop somebody from moving forward or stop them from breaking free or having confidence in themselves or whatever this is. It's like, girl, get the fuck out of here. Somebody could be seen in a public eye. You could be getting ready to um, maybe start something new or something is, I feel like whatever this risk that you're taking or your person is taking with you, I feel like it's going to lead to success or it has already. And somebody is trying to five of swords it. What's the two of pentacles in the reverse, child? This could be two where somebody is a player. They have a lot of people around them that want their attention or they're giving attention to a lot of people. But they want to keep being on your line, though. It's like, bitch, get your whole ass on somewhere. What's the dad to a pentacles in the reverse? It's like, what the fuck do you want? Nothing? Okay, yeah, the hermit in the reverse. 
Yeah, somebody's like paranoid or scared that something's going to come out or that you're going to be seen as something that um they're not. You're going to be seen as somebody that got all the fucking sense in the world and they don't have any. Okay, it's like somebody somebody is like pressed about their image. They don't want to be seen a certain way is what it's, what it's giving me here. You could be dealing with a, a Virgo. I feel like somebody is trying to get away from someone, but they can't too. There, there's another situation going on. What's this hermit in reverse? Somebody's like scared. What's the hermit in the reverse? The Knight of Swords. Yeah, somebody's like attacking someone or, or threatening them or something like that. But this is a plan or a strategy to keep someone stuck. So... It's like if somebody's texting someone on the phone, they're taking in what they're saying. So I feel like if you, you shouldn't. If you got kids with this bitch, block them until it's time for them to get the kids. Unblock them. Yeah, unblock them when it's time for them to get the kids or something. If you're texting somebody, constantly arguing, stop doing that. Have more control over your emotions. Okay. <clears throat> but yeah, I feel like um, with the Hermit in Reverse too, I was getting with the Knight of Souls, Hermit in Reverse... Somebody is coming out of hermit mode. They're getting ready to take action and make big changes in their life here. Whoever this, whoever this is that somebody is like dealing with, they're a fucking clown. They're a loser and they're a whore. I feel like it's this damn queen of pentacles in the fucking reverse. Okay. What's this damn, uh, the seven of cups? For some of you, there's somebody that you're not speaking to. That feels like they're going to be in and out of your life here when they want to. They could be trying to play around in your dream state too. You could be having weird dreams about this bitch trying to take something or they're trying to like do something because they're trying to hide or cloak their energy. So whatever they're doing, Queen of Pentacles in the reverse is magic. They're, they're, they are obsessed with dark magic. So somebody could be trying to do some shit too to fuck up your, yeah, the devil. Ten of Wands, Queen of Wands, Empress, Page of Cups. I don't know. There's a lot of weird shit going on. What's the seven of cups here? Four of cups. Cancer moon. What's seven of cups? Four of cups. The devil. <laughs> somebody is being rejected. They don't like it. This could be like somebody's like, oh, woe is me. Very apathetic, discontent, miserable person. They're just sitting here looking fucked up because they are fucked up. Capricorn energy with the devil. You averted some sort of like tower here. Somebody thought they was going to get a victory by taking a risk and doing something to you in your dream state or something like that. Because you're not responding to this person. You're not talking to them. So they feel like, well, somebody keep conjuring. I feel like there's a middleman here is what I'm getting. Somebody's like conjuring up some shit. They do this shit all the time. They do this shit all the time. So for some of you, they had you guys in isolation or had you guys having to work through something here with your person, with your, I was going to say counterpart, because this connection is protected. They're, ta they're attacking a connection or some shit. So I feel like now you're coming out of hermit mode. You're coming out and you're getting ready to take action here. You know exactly what you want to do, where you're going. I feel like you're ambitious, you're driven, you're not isolated no more. So, so now some getting ready to backfire, whatever the fuck this is. They're not getting a response or they're not because this doesn't have to be like actually texting or phone shit, 3D shit. This could be spiritual. They're not getting any kind of like um, response to whatever they're, they're sending out. Okay. I feel like they're trying to cause delays, though, with you and your person's communication. I feel like y'all work right through it. Somebody's trying to separate you, you and somebody. It's not. Yeah, the four of wands, the strength card, the union is too strong, whatever this is. Yeah, all you need to do is communicate. Queen of Swords, Ace of Swords, and the Judgment. Communication is key. That's all you need to do is communicate. And I feel like every time you communicate, y'all union gets stronger. Definitely could be twins. I don't know, though. What's the devil? So somebody's, like, confused. What's the damn devil, child? <laughs> okay, Ten of Cubs. Yeah, somebody's, like, obsessed with... 
your your um connection yeah the magician and the emperor and the, the the damn wheel of fortune so somebody's like obsessed with something that you're getting i feel like this is a destined partnership with the ten of cups coming out somebody that you're meant to be with yeah it's like confusing because it's like yeah i'm meant to be with this person but why do i feel like i'm not it's magic or somebody's doing some weird shit over here what's the devil with the ten of cups or some try somebody trying to convince you that what you're getting into is toxic you're not supposed to do it so it's making somebody hold back or be distant or whatever the fuck. Yeah, it's like, bitch, nice try, ho. What's the devil with the Ten of Cups? Yeah, the Five of Pentacles. Like, why do I feel left out in the cold? Or, yeah, when I'm in love with somebody, why do I feel like I want to walk away? I feel like you're realizing what this is. Like, it's, it's... You bitches are fucking clowns. I'm telling you, boy. <laughs> If it ain't one thing, it's another with you trash ass hoes. Y'all lame as fuck with this fucking magic. That's all you bitches do is sit around and do magic all motherfucking day. You ain't got no fucking real job. You ain't got shit going for yourself but a bunch of black magic that always gets reversed. Page of Wands in the reverse. It's like something is always happening with you bitches. And then you be wondering why. It's like, are you fucking insane? Or are you taking over by these damn demons that, ha yeah, the emperor to the empress. Are you taking over by these damn demons that you've conjured up, bitch? You gotta be slow as fuck. Like, real shit. I feel like if you and this person are in a relationship, all y'all do is fucking take space from each other and, and reflect. And then re you come back to come back down to earth, bitch. You realize that you're, you're tripping. And with the will, the emperor, the magician, the seven of wands. Yeah, I feel like the fight still is on. Okay, seven of wands is like um, standing up for what you believe in. The empress with the page of cups. It's just like something is not working. So now whatever you sent out, bitch, is going back. I hope you're ready for it. I hope you're ready for it. That's why your relationships and shit falling apart, bitch. Or you don't have one, dummy. Yeah, ten of swords because you're constantly hexing and, and cursing somebody. Or this, bi this bitch-ass man right here could be with this, this queen of pentacles in reverse. They could be paying this person to do shit. Okay, to fuck up a union or whatever the fuck this is. Child, get the fuck out of here. What's exaggeration here? What's exaggeration? I feel like somebody mad because this, this man could have walked away from them or something like that. And now they're targeting you. Obviously, you had something. Yeah, two of cups. Yeah. Blowing things out of proportion, not that deep. Yeah, because it's not. Okay, two of cups right here with this. Yeah, it's not that deep between you and whoever this is that you with. Yeah. Y'all love each other. It's mutual respect. Child, first when this came out, I was about to say, who the, how the fuck you going to invalidate my feelings, bitch? It is that deep. But I feel like now I see what's going on. It's not that deep. What's the exaggeration with the two of cups? Okay. Because I feel like y'all love each other. Love here conquers all. And I feel like that's what's being shown. These bitches are mad because they raggedy as fuck. They don't believe in love or, oh, I don't want love and I'm sick of love. I'm just going to be a hoe for the rest of my fucking life or I'm just going to live with a bunch of cats and dogs and nobody's going to ever love me. It's like, bitch, heal and shut the fuck up. Stop doing that fucking... The world is already fucked up in that sense. So much hate going on. There is no love in the world and you bitches are running around just raggedy. What's the ex exaggeration with the two of cups? Okay, yeah, page of swords. Yeah, so somebody's watching your relationship. They're watching you playing mind games or trying to strategize certain things. They're watching the dynamics of it, how much love is here, how much is not there. Okay, like somebody's like really just researching, analyzing, like they're lame. But this page of swords could be um, you and this person like talking or, or speaking up to one another or whatever, communicating. What's the damn page of swords? The fool. Yeah, a distraction. Thank you, Spirit. Aquarius. Whatever this is, is a distraction. That's all. It's a distraction here. Page of Swords with the Fool in the reverse. What's the Two of Cups? <laughs> yeah, Ace of Swords. Communication. To shift y'all perspective. To get back on the same page. That's all you need. Y'all on the same page. There's nothing to worry about. There's nothing. Absolutely nothing to worry about. <laughs> You pick the right person, that's your person. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, that's, I mean, 
that's it <laughs> like i mean you, there's a breakthrough here that's happening what's the ace of swords okay yep ace of pentacles so, something solid stable there, that's loyalty commitment okay i feel like somebody could be asking you to marry them soon for some of you like dead ass Whatever this is, it's a breakthrough here. This is the one for you. This communication is top tier. <laughs> I feel like that's what's building the trust in y'all connection. That's what's building the trust in y'all connection here. Communication. Just it's something solid. So whatever somebody is trying to do, bitch, you mad because your relationship is trash. That's what you deserve. Look at how you're acting. You deserve all the trash in the world, honey. Move the fuck on. So what's can't even in the reverse? Yeah, three of cups in the reverse, gossiping, somebody here cheating, running around with hoes. Okay, like, can't comprehend. Bitch, you can comprehend. Ain't shit wrong with your fucking mind, ho. Besides the fact that you, I don't know, maybe something is wrong with you. For you to be sitting up here doing this, something gotta be wrong with you, hoes. But somebody here could be lonely, three of cups in the reverse. Like, they didn't cut off everybody because... Everybody, what, turning on them or they, they turn on every fucking body. Like, somebody's connections is fucked up because they just are not learning. This could be another cancer or they got that shit in their chart. What's can't even in the reverse with the with the three of cups in the reverse? The temperance. Yeah, I feel like you're being protected from all this shit. This is like divine intervention. Some sort of gossip and all this stupid shit here. Somebody's like a cheater. They're a loser. They overindulge in certain shit. This is the three of cups in the reverse, you know? <laughs> The sun. <laughs> so yeah, something being exposed about a gossiping asshole, a third party, or somebody's being exposed for being a fucking cheater. They're a damn loser. That's all. Somebody could have slept with someone's friend and got pregnant. I keep getting that. Yeah, nine of cups. Okay, confirmation. I feel like you're the, the sun though is like freedom. You're happy, you're free, you're optimistic, you're joyful, like legit. <laughs> you're not what's the three of cups in the reverse with the sun? The judgment, the five of swords, and the hierophant. Wow. Taurus, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sag. Someone can have an Aquarius Venus here. So yeah, somebody's just so fucking miserable. <laughs> they're so miserable here that they're mad because they're alone or they got to run around and cheat and they don't have something solid. That's what this sound like. So they're trying to like interfere with the Hierophant and the the Five of Swords talks about, I feel like this is you standing up for yourself. The Five of Swords will talk about having a victory. Okay, the Chariot there as well. You stood up for yourself. You fought, you fought back here. There was some sort of lesson that you just learned or, or you're you're learning it. You pass the test or y'all just keep on leveling up here in this connection or whatever. Yeah, the high priest is poking out. Yeah, with the strength card. Exactly. You and this person here, y'all love each other. Yeah, strong twin flame connection. That's just period. That's what this feels like with the four wands behind it. Ten of damn pentacles, confirmation. Nine of pentacles, the ace of cups, the page of cups, the emperor. Yeah, the wheel. Yeah. This is a very strong connection that's, that can stand the test of time. That's just period. Some of y'all could be, actually be like um, pregnant, okay? Or this is like marriage or all, all of it. A good business, marriage, and kids. The life that for some of you, you're manifesting. You want it. It's coming. Or you're meant for it. So you can't deny it. And if you do, you're just going to be miserable. Like you can't deny your path. You're destined to be with this person. That's just period. Wow. <laughs> you transmuted the fuck out this energy, boy. <laughs> that energy is transmuted, honey. I don't know what you did, but you, I mean, you just transmuted it. What's the temperance? Because there's balance here that's created, or there could even be like a reconciliation. You and this person could live at a distance for some of you. Spirit is testing you to see how you're moving in this connection if you really want it. I feel like you do really want it. Yeah, and there's somebody from your past that's mad or in denial or whatever the fuck this is. It's like, get over it, bitch. What's the temperance? This masculine here is upright. They are. They, this could be like a masculine here. 
that's leveling up too. The, the Hierophant with the Sun, that's a masculine energy. Five of Swords and the Judgment. What's the... This could be a cult here that you're, they're seeing that's attacking you. A group of bitches that can't keep a man. <laughs> okay, what's the Temperance? They're attacking you and shit like that. I feel like you know that that's going on, so you know how to handle it. It's like, bitch, we know what you're doing. Go find something else to do. Yeah, the Ten of Wands in the reverse. What's the temperance here with the Ten of Wands in the reverse? So, yeah, it's like some, somebody's beating a dead horse. Something is just burdensome. It's tiresome for somebody. They're really overwhelmed from trying to do all this extra shit that they're doing. But I feel like this could be you releasing and letting go. Ten of Wands in reverse. What's the... The, the weight, the, the, whatever was weighing y'all down or making you feel like so intense or like heavy emotions or something, I feel like it's off of you now. Okay, where there was like a lack of fun or spontaneity in the connection, I feel like someone's getting ready to spice on up here or y'all getting ready to go back to how y'all was because I feel like somebody here try to, you know what I'm saying, do the most. What's the temperance with the Ten of Wands in the reverse? Feel like you made the right yeah the, the will of fortune feel like you made the right judgment call with the with the um judgment that's self-awareness so i feel like yeah this person here is self-aware they're very much so self-aware that if they're tripping or i feel like you make this person understand what kind of connection y'all got too because the masculine normally is the one the man in the situation they're normally the one that's still a bit like they don't know what the fuck going on okay you have to break it down to their ass okay and let them know like yeah this is what it is believe it okay like you need to fucking believe it and and do you're going to have to protect our union, honey. Okay, just period. So I feel like, yeah, with the will, things are turning in your favor. I feel like um, you're you're coming. Things are balancing out here. For some of you guys, you could be getting ready to see this person or some shit. Okay, there's good karma coming in here. The will is turning. Give me a card spirit that's in alignment with the spread for um, cancer. I'm about to call you Cappy. Kira. Okay, bottom of the deck is Freya. Hmm. I landed right on her page. So it says the key word, responsibility. The symbols are peacock, cow, polos, crown. The affirmation is I take responsibility for my life. So it says Hera is the queen of the Greek gods. She is a protector of women and presided over marriage, women, and childbirth. As one of the Greek pantheon's most pro prolific mother goddesses, she represents both the positive side and darker sides of motherhood and responsibilities. Excuse me. She is a serious goddess who is known to be rather vengeful. She perceives someone has crossed her. Excuse me. <laughs> she does not play around. So it says here often arise in a reading when someone needs to take responsibility or be held accountable for their actions or how a situation has unfolded. Taking responsibility means cleaning up your messes and making changes so it doesn't happen again. Not just hoping that everything will just mag magically sort itself out. Being accountable can be difficult, but we all make mistakes and it is through owning these mistakes that we can grow as a person and live an authentic life. So it says work with Hera. Wear a peacock charm or an image of a peacock as a way to invoke Hera's energy. Journal about a current or past situation that you need to take responsibility for and look for the lessons. Okay, yeah, and create a simple daily ritual of responsibility each day as making your such as making your bed. So, yeah, this could be, um, <clears throat> somebody here, th there's a masculine, I feel like you're with this person. They are, whatever they're doing internally, I feel like it's, it's helping y'all connection, just period. It's creating balance here, because this person, this person is very powerful. They're a healer themselves, and I feel like they're healing, okay, from a, a, a some sort of relationship here where they where either they cheated or somebody here cheated on them and shit like that i feel like they're taking responsibility for the fact that they might have placed you in that category of being a cheater or a hoe or whatever this is not you know because twin flames they don't they don't be outright you know what i'm saying being a dick i feel like they just 
this person needs to understand what kind of relationship this is and that you wouldn't do that shit to them. So they might have came off a bit weird or started treating you. You know what I'm saying? Started trying to ghost a little bit or like they got quiet. Okay. Somebody's suspecting something, but they're confused. They couldn't really figure it out. Or maybe you didn't text back or answer this person's call at the, at the time that they felt like you should. So they, you know, they kind of got a bit scared or whatever. Par they, 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 yeah, the Knight of Swords with the Hermit in the reverse paranoia. They could have given, re they could have been getting ready to act off impulse. Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's, it's somebody here. This Queen of Pentacles in reverse. They, they sending you some sort of magic. But it could be, if it's not, it's somebody baby mama here that's just raggedy and they just keep being in this person's energy or whatever the fuck, or this is you or something. But let me know if this resonated, Cancer. I hope it did. Like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on, press the all button so you guys won't miss my readings. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.